Kia ora, good afternoon. I'm Paul Arsa and I'm a 24 year old male from Christchurch, New Zealand. I'm also a recent graduate of the University of Canterbury with a bachelor's in marketing. Now, I'm here today to tell you why I believe I would be a great graduate ambassador for Braincott Estate and furthermore, Bernard Rickards winemakers. So let me off first, I love New Zealand. I think New Zealand is one of the most beautiful and spectacular countries in the world. Now I've traveled far and beyond and I've never seen anything quite like New Zealand, whether it's just the people or, as I said, the landscapes. Now, New Zealand wine ties in with that perfectly. And I'm passionate about New Zealand wines. I think they are some of the best in the world. When you look at the Marlborough Sound Sauvignon Blanc, to the Central Targo Pinot Noir. Some of the best, the brilliant, the perfect. I actually holidayed home, had a holiday home up in Marlborough Sounds, and I saw the explosion of that area and to become one of the most leading and innovative wine regions in the world. And I'm, I can tell you, I'm so proud of that. So as I said, I'm proud of New Zealand and I'm proud of New Zealand wine. Now, I'd just like to go and talk about my past year, my past year I spent overseas in Whistler, which is two hours north of Vancouver, Canada. Now while I was there, I was working for a company for a hotel, the Four Seasons, which is a five star resort. Now while I was working there, I was a bartender. Now this gave me a valuable chance to talk to customers and see how they perceive New Zealand. They perceive New Zealand as a, you know, it's a beautiful, beautiful country. The, you know, the ideas they put the, the Hobbit, the Lord of the Rings, the All Blacks, the Haka, and just overall natural beauty and great people. Now, however, so starting off in this great image, only a few of them had actually regularly drank New Zealand wine, and they loved it. The ones that drink it love it. They think it's, you know, some of the best wine in the world. But there's a lot of those people have never tasted New Zealand wine. And I put it down to, from talking to them, was just accessibility and brand awareness. They just did not know New Zealand brands. They didn't want to move away from, you know, from the European wines, from something that they perceived as safe, or the Okanagan, or the Napa wines. But that is part, odd view is that part of my mission is to pioneer, to pioneer a new industry and new brand awareness so these people that knew New Zealand could go out there and look for New Zealand wine. And that's just partly talking to bartenders, to the people that sell to the end consumer. So they get out there and they're proud, they know the product and they can sell the product. And I reckon once we do that, we'll sell a sh or we'll explode. So anyway, I'm Paul Issa. Thank, thank you for listening to me and I look forward to hearing from you again. Thank you very much.